Hello, this is Bruce Long, director of the IU Radiolo Radiologic Sciences programs. We have three programs uh, to offer you. We have an associate degree in radiography, and we have bachelor's degrees in both nuclear medicine technology and in medical imaging technology. I've always been interested in medicine, and when I started school years ago, I also liked journalism. So I found the prof one profession that fit me both that I could do pictures and medicine, so I decided to take pictures of bones, something I've always liked. went to St. Francis, a hospital in the area, and asked if I could shadow. Uh, they told me, yes, this is a pretty common occurrence for people who want to get into the program. So I shadowed, and I liked what I did. So I then proceeded to get a job at St. Francis in the x-ray department, which gave me a lot of um, background and experience just sort of in the field, see what kind of things the techs do on a daily basis. I got into all the technology of the x-rays and how it's just growing and growing and that field excited me and after I got into it I've had to learn that there's it's I've been told it's more of an art than a science it's where art meets science. As far as the profession itself goes uh, for those of you who would be deciding whether you wanted to go into a profession like radiography you need to recognize that we are a direct patient care uh, profession. Even though nurses primarily are responsible for patient care, uh, whenever a patient is having an imaging study done, then we are responsible for their patient care during that period of time. So you still have to want to take care directly of a patient in order to be able to work in the area. It's important that you um, are very understanding and I think you need to have a thick skin because a lot of people are sick and they can be mean and you know you have to realize that they're only mean because they're not feeling well. I think one of the hardest things to deal with after getting into the program is seeing just how sick some of the patients are. Uh, most of the time and in my experience as well when you shadow you do a lot of the outpatient things which is kids who broke their legs playing sports, um, basic people who just walk in off the street However, in the clinical settings, you do get a lot of sick people, and that can be hard to deal with. Any of the diagnostic imaging modality areas have uh, very good job outlooks right now. Um, we have as a, a national benchmark, 75% of our students should have a job working in the field within six months of graduation, and we always exceed that every year. It is the closest to a guaranteed job you can get, even though no one can obviously ever guarantee that.